What's going on guys, JT43 here. In today's video, I'm gonna try and show some cool cars at the uh, Raceway Park car show. It's supposed to be an all JDM meet. So I'll just go check out what they have, see if they got anything cool there. So uh, I'll see you there. So I just arrived, you can see that big ass thing right there. There's all the parking over there. It's kind of hard to like film and drive at the same time, but they also have time attack going on over there. I saw fucking Type R getting active over there. It's pretty cool. And you got like a little like, graveyard for the drift cars that didn't make it two is 300s and then i guess these are uh people for like the time attack stuff like that that's pretty cool it's a pretty cool then so you can see there's a little sneak peek of what we're gonna be heading into i already see some really clean cars like right there they got a subaru svx right smack in the middle right there that's gonna be cool to check out. You don't usually see a lot of those shits. Right here in the parking, I haven't even gotten into the event yet and there's already a Supra just chilling over there. The parking lot's also cool. I think I'm gonna check out the parking lot and spot the interesting cars in there too. Rolling up, we got a Hawkeye. I'm just kind of showing you like what to expect out of this place, you know? You got this thing over here. That's a very interesting wing. Yellow S2K rolling up. That thing looks clean. So there's the event over there. And then literally in the distance, they have a whole like motocross track. Like you can, yeah, you can, oh, you can see them like doing jumps and shit. That's awesome. So we got gray here. Park next to two uh, really clean Corvettes. You got the blue one, the orange one, and then not too far away, that Supra that I showed when I was standing in line. That Supra's right over here. Look how clean this thing is, man. Nice wheels, got the nice red interior. Carbon wing, this thing's nice for sure. So here's something pretty cool. This is a car I've wanted for so long, but the SC400. Yeah, this thing's pretty cool. These things are always really cool. Like a nice drift build and shit. And I don't know why, but this thing's chilling on a steely, man. Like, what the fuck? Another car I'd like to own in the future, IS300. Nice 2J swap. Obviously, this one's pretty beat, but, you know, a nice clean example. These things would be fucking awesome. Got this clean WRX. Park slanted. This one and that uh, Civic. Alongside what I was just talking about. Nice IS300. This is a pretty good example. You know, he's got the Toyota swap down below him. It's pretty cool. This is the color I'd probably want too, and the nice blue, some nice wheels. Here's that S2000 that we saw from the car. This thing's really fucking clean, man. This thing is fucking awesome. I don't know, too expensive to own though. Got the Honda Fit on some wheels. Man, they even got, you can barely hear me. Dude, they even have drifting here too. As soon as I heard the tires screeching, I skipped all the cars. I went right to the track.
out in here, but look at this clean line up here. Nice Civic, Rally Subaru. I believe that's a GC8, I could be wrong though. And then you got this right here. I'm gonna go to the back section first because they're playing a lot of copyrighted music, so. You got this Subaru Hawkeye, look at this shit, man. All that titanium, this thing's really cool. Man, you gotta give it to the Toyota boys, man. I, I think this is a completely stock Toyota Supra. Untouched, maybe, except for that air filter. Completely untouched <laughs> to the interior. Everything's OEM. It's hard to find these things like OEM condition. This thing's really cool. Right next to it, S15 Sylvia Spec R. Well, I don't know if it's a real spec car, but it says spec car on the side right there. This thing too. But this thing too is really sick. OEM looking. I think those are uh, OEM wheels. I could be wrong though. This thing is super clean. So here are two cars that like people don't really like to modify. Accord wagons. Slam. God, man, look at these things. And right next to it, Toyota Century. V12 Toyota Century. On some wheels. With the VIP curtains. Right hand drive. Oh, baby seat in the bag. This, I wish he popped the hood, man. I want to see that V12. These things are really rare. Especially in this good of condition. That is really fucking cool. So we got here, 1979, 280ZX, LS swapped. Look at this thing. Look at the condition of this thing. Even got the pipes. Pissing all the muscle car guys off. Backup camera. It's even got a screen in it that plays TV. Man. Doesn't get any more JDM than this. And you can fit like stuff for people back there. It's fucking awesome. So over here we got uh, I think it's either a, a Scion FRS or maybe a D-Badge 86. I think it's an FRS. Just look how crazy this thing is. And the front end is the craziest. They made it look like an RC front end, which I, I don't know. I thought it was I thought it was pretty cool. We're gonna wheels, find out. The wheels look good too. I like the wheel out. color. And then over here for those Toyota boys, uh, this nice Corolla. EQs or look at this thing. EQs can be, uh, look at that turbo. You know, yeah, we gotta do the spin. Damn. Keep it a hundred. Hey, yo, you got over there? And the livery on the side. You got right here. You got right here, my friend. This thing is clean. What y'all think about?
probably my favorite of the lineup, Nissan Stasia. Pretty much like an R34 wagon. I think they came with an RB25. Also a car I'd like to own, an Alteza wagon. Yeah, they exist. Alteza wagons, but this one's pretty special. This one's got a 2JZ. Look at this thing. Look at this turbo. Clean as fuck. Some clean Civics. Look at this engine there. That was really clean. Another. Oh, look at this. That's really clean. This is what I'm talking about. So this is a Nissan Stasia. It's basically a R34 wagon. You can do the front end conversion, but the back is a Stasia. Look at this thing. This thing is fucking awesome. Especially the wheels. Look at these wheels. Look at the meat, look at the meat on these wheels. Meaty ass fucking wheels. Over here, R32 four door GTST with the RB20 in it. Nice, this is probably a drift car. I'm gonna guess this is a drift car. Next to an R35. It's got a football in it, I don't really know why, but it looks cool. Over here, we have a lowered Odyssey. On like modern Honda wheels. This thing is really clean, like reflective clean. 350Z. Not something you see every day, a lowered Odyssey like that. It's pretty cool. Over here we got a purple 300ZX. Oh, look at these wheels, man. Look at those. And then look how much space you have to work on the engine. As you can see, very, very fucking roomy. Not really, that's, that would be a headache. Really bagged, S2000. Like, really, really bagged. Yeah, it's hook. Really, really clean. See the interior. Carbon fiber top, really, really nice. We got some Time Attack Civics. These things are pretty serious, man. Look at this arrow. It's made out of wood, too. Look at this arrow. Carbon fiber hood. Um, all the good stuff. All the good stuff in there. Let's look at the paint, too. You can really see that flake in there. It's really cool. I think this is a no, trunk mount. Then we have the second one. This one's completely gutted out. Like, completely gutted out. Nice, clean CRX. And over here. Nice Integra Type R, if it's real. It might not be real. Followed by another one, carbon fiber door. Followed by an EG. Really clean EG. We have this line of Eclipses. We got one, we got two, and then we got an Eagle Talon, which is pretty much a part of the trio. We got the Mitsubishi, Eagle Talon, and then the Chrysler. And here's one for them Toyota boys, man. AE86 Hachiroko Torino. Look at that thing, man. This thing is clean. It's not the Panda, it's the white on white. Just look at the interior. The interior on this thing. Wheels too, he's got he's rocking the rays. Really, really sick. Super super clean NSX carbon fiber hood. Really really clean. DQ struggle on the startup. That kind of sucks. We got this thing. Little Honda Grom. Oh shit. And then, of course, 
tandem wide body kit. R32. <laughs> R32 Skyline. This thing's really nice. So this this guy's letting me show his interior. In a 350Z. Look at that steering wheel. That is crazy. So over here we have some Evos. Uh, I want to say this is an Evo 9 or Evo 8. I'm not really sure. Evo 10. Looking murdered out. Oh yeah, dude. Look at this thing. Got it in the rear. There's the interior. guys are getting ready to go for a run. Looking awesome. And I guess I'll save the old classics for last. It's a little quieter now. Um, but we have this whole lineup here. I'll quickly go over these cars real quick. First gen RX-7. Ooh, Target 7. Look at this interior, man. Smells like a brand new car in there. Yeah, look at this. Moving on to this thing, this Suzuki. This thing is sick. It looks like a little death trap, but definitely looks really cool. We have this Toyota right here. A8611. This nice panda red. Those wheels look nice. Another A86, the actual panda. With the hood open so you can take a look. Ooh, nice Dotson. SR5. So I saved the classics for last. I'll show the engine bay real quick. Shop the best savings of the season at Alright, I am now back in my car. About to head home. I spent a good couple hours here. Um, I think I showed pretty interesting cars. It's getting kind of hectic though, like people leaving and shit. They got cops all down there just pulling people over, man. It's kind of funny. But um, yeah, I think I showed some pretty cool cars, some pretty interesting cars. Anyway, if you did enjoy the video, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later.